hey queens welcome back to my channel this is Inga welcome 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 and welcome to you newbies and if you would love to be a part of this Queens Nation just go ahead and smash that subscribe button we would love to have you join us on this journey and this is where I do DIYs I do business and entrepreneurship videos and lifestyle so just go ahead and smash that subscribe button Hey lovelies, so today I am going to be making a matte finish for you guys and I purchased this product from TKB. It's called Isodotacane and it comes in this 8 ounce package. I think you can get little samples of it also. I'm not sure but I just got this 8 ounce package just to see how it'll go and as you can see it has a very light watery consistency almost like water. Yes unlike the um, glycerin and the hydronated polyisopatin that has that like sort of like silky um, touch to it this is more watery I didn't touch it but you can just look at it and see it's just like water and I'm gonna be using this pipette to just draw it out and we are going to be making a matte finish today so I am excited about this so let's just go and see how this is gonna come out so I am going to be using the titanium dioxide and I think it's a uh, oil dispersed titanium dioxide yeah because I think I might need a little bit of moisture for this um, I'll explain about the benefits and the uses of the isodotacane like I said in this video so I just strain the titanium dioxide and I'm just gonna mix it with a little bit of white lip liquid that it's mixed already just a tad bit of it so right now I'm just adding a little bit of Versagel into this mixture I'm not gonna do a whole bit of this because I just this is just a sample we're just trying this to see how it comes out so hopefully it does come out very well but this is a little bit of Versagel I am mixing with this right now so as you can see right now we have a creamy base going on here and this is what we need for our matte finish we need to first have this creamy base going on right here so this is why I'm using the titanium dioxide if you have um, seen or done any of this before you would know that these type of finishes are mixed with combination of waxes but I am using titanium dioxide as my preferred product for this so let's go ahead and further explain this what is isodotacane isodotacane is a common ingredient found in cosmetic skincare and body care isodotacane is primarily used to help keep the product soft and easy to apply this product is used in many different cosmetics because of its low instances of side effects and it also has an added benefit it adds a matte finish to lipstick formulation or lip liquids so if you would read up on this product at TKB it will say isodotacane is 100% synthetic and contains no animal derived ingredients so it would be suitable for vegan cosmetics so once again it is a very light weighted emollient and solvent it gives your product a nice slip because of the light weight it has a shelf life of two years and it also gives your lip product a matte finish so the color that I'm gonna be going here for is more like a nude natural type color and as you can see I'm putting it in my strainer right now and I'm just gonna strain it and also this is a dioxide that I'm using so I'm just gonna go along mixing this now and you will also see when I add the isodocaine into this mixture so I'm just gonna go and mix this very well and you will see that nude color starts to appear so I'm just gonna go ahead and add a tad bit of grapeseed oil into this mixture and also the isodocaine in it as well so let me get this name correct i think i am pronouncing it wrong it's isodotacane that's the correct pronunciation but i will have the 
correct spelling and writing for it going across here so you guys will know what I'm talking about you know you know you know so this nude right here this is the thing they came out perfect I got two colors that I did so I'm just gonna go through them quickly as you can see it's very creamy it's caramelly it's nude it's the nudest it's very naked as you can see <laughs> it came out good um, as you can see I'm gonna get ready to swatch it right now for you guys and you will wow. see how this mixture just came out as the perfect matte lip color so this is more of a reddish um, rosy type that color that I'm mixing right now and I added some rose gold pigment in this and let's see how this one comes out this shade of matte lip color that I'm mixing right here is very popular um, it's a popular shade for matte lip liquid colors and I think you're gonna absolutely love this color because I did so I'm just gonna continue mixing this and then I'm gonna do a swatch with this one also and watch out guys look how this came out I absolutely adore this one so just look how this came out I think it's the perfect color oh, wow so overall because of the isodotacane in this um, mixture it's going to be long lasting it will not um, transfer to anything that you're drinking eating and so forth like that so if you guys want to try this out or try this method you can just go ahead and follow these steps and remember guys this is just for my personal use um, I don't have this on my website for sale or anything but you're free to go and try it for yourself okay and I'll see you guys in my next video so so long